Welcome to the first episode of a Skewed Reviews Food Reviews. So today's review is in honor of a new movie that just came out, Beetlejuice Beetlejuice. And the food product that I'm reviewing today is the movie tie-in Fanta drink, Haunted Apple. Now technically there were actually quite a few other flavors that they also released in line with this film, but I could not find any of the other ones, so I'm just doing the one that had Beetlejuice on the cover. So here I am about to try the drink, and now I'm going to give you my inner thoughts as I try it. Here I am opening it. And immediately when I smell this, it's an interesting pungent aroma, as if I opened up a package of potpourri. And now here I am trying it. So the immediate flavor that comes to me was interesting, but then it quickly turned into something that was not very good at all. I'm going to try it again and see what I feel on a second taste. Nope, nope, this is, uh, this is pure garbage. So the aftertaste is just kind of okay, and I attempted to put this away and try this throughout the rest of my day, but honestly, I couldn't finish it and ended up just tossing it out. So when I first picked up this drink, I really thought maybe this would actually taste like a green apple or one of those caramel green apple lollipops. But what it actually tasted like was more of a combination of maple syrup mixed with a bag of autumn scented potpourri and some sort of fall scented candle. I would also say that's what it smelled like. Now, not to be gross, but I did at least taste a little bit of apple after belching from drinking this, but it was kind of that taste of apple that you would get if LaCroix made a green apple flavor. So all in all, when it comes to Fanta Haunted Apple, this drink is not for me personally. I would say everyone should at least try it because I'm sure somebody out there will like this flavor, and it's definitely distinctive enough to really be its own thing. But for me, I'm going to give this one a 1 out of 5. So I hope you enjoyed this first episode of a Skewed Reviews Food Reviews. And if there's any other foods or drinks or candy or anything else that you think I should try, definitely let me know in the comments. Additionally, if you just want to torture me by having me eat hot and spicy or sour stuff or whatever, feel free to add those in as well. And finally, if you can, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to all the rest of my askewed reviews.